Mit navn er John Brødersen. Jeg er praktiserende læge og professor på Københavns Universitet, og derfor kommer jeg fra Danmark. Showmore spine means to me the courage, because the general practitioner are sitting in the swampy lowlands of uncertainty, and here you have to show courage to stand up and say, this is not disease, this is actual a normal condition. Uh, I think that vertebral fractures is a beautiful example of widening uh, the disease definitions, uh, going from risk factors to uh, a disease. Uh, we have the dilemma, the issue that patients uh, come to us in general practice, they are asymptomatic, and some of them they have maybe uh, gone to an examination via a private insurance company, uh, maybe because somebody told them that it was good and suddenly there is some pathology or some abnormality on the imaging and vertebral fractures are exactly an example of that, that the patient may have no symptoms but there's some pathology, some abnormality on the x-ray. Is this a disease? Is this, uh, is this something that is uh, abnormal? Is this a natural phenomenon in biology? Is this something people Uh, we all have. Uh, does this mean anything? Does it make any sense? Is it clinical meaningful? Does it predict anything to the patient? This is all the questions that you have to raise and you can't really answer any of them. We certainly turn this patient into having illness. Uh, the patient will be concerned. Uh, they are told they have a fracture on the image. Uh, they, they begin to to talk to me what will be the future. We know from uh, research that these women will begin to look at themselves as vulnerable. Some of them will do a, a, exactly the opposite of what they should do. They stop exercising, they stop uh, doing their normal work because they're afraid they will fall or have another fracture in the spine. So actually this, what I would call the iatrogenic process is starting. If I should be really provocative, uh, cancer is not a disease anymore. Cancer is a risk factor. Um, if we have old men uh, and uh, they die from other reasons than cancer and we do an autopsy, most of these old men will have a, a pathology in their prostate gland and this pathology is equal to prostate cancer. But these men will never have any symptoms from, from it. And if I, as a GP, took a screening test for this prostate cancer, it would be elevated in a lot of these men, and they would need biopsies, and you will find this indolent, harmless pathological condition. That is not a disease, because the patient, the person, will never get any symptoms from it. So actually, it's not only about uh, risk factors, it's also about what we tend to call disease, that pathology is not equal to disease. We are talking about cancer as one disease, it's not. Uh, then you can split it into different organs, and uh, then we're talking about breast cancer as one disease, and it's not. There might be 50, there might be 100, might be a thousand different types of breast cancer with very, very different pronostic uh, numbers.